Video Productions. What's going on YouTube? Uh, so today I'm going to do a little review. It's something that's not new, it's been out for a few years, you've probably seen it, but I just picked it up. You know what, let me just show you what it is. Alright, so I just picked this up. I, I'm going to try to do a demonstration, compare it to a S1R. Uh, my batteries are dead, so I'm waiting for batteries to come in for that one. So hopefully uh, tomorrow night I'll go out and do a little demonstration. But for now, I'm going to do an unboxing and uh, we'll go over this flashlight. Alright? Alright, here we go. So it comes with a little lanyard here. Here is the flashlight itself. Okay, so no charger or anything like that. Uh, let's see. Does it come? Oh, no battery, no battery everybody. So, <laughs> comes with a battery sleeve. Okay, cool, so, and it says here in the manual. It comes with the S2 baton, battery, magazine, lanyard, and manual. Awesome. Okay, so instead of just reading the specs to you, I'll just let you view over all the specs that are in the manual. It's going to be a lot easier to do it that way. Okay, so now that you've seen the specs on the manual, I'm going to go over a couple things that I find interesting. So this thing can run on two batteries, one being one 18650 battery, or two CR123A batteries. I actually like 18650 batteries because it's really easy to get good chargers for them. Some people like the flashlight to charge the battery for them, like uh, my Olight S1R. It um, you know has a little blue magnetic charging thing. Uh, I actually prefer the 18650s. I did vape for a little while. Yeah, insert funny joke here, whatever. Uh, those 18650 batteries are pretty badass for those, and the I still have a whole bunch of chargers for them. So I actually prefer that anyway, so that's probably what I'll do, especially since it only needs one. Uh, those things last a while, so that should be pretty good. Also, I don't know if you noticed while reading this, or if you even read it at all, but the output time for the battery life for the 18650 is actually better than the uh, CR123As um, for, if you have it on a high setting, like it said, the 18650 is 245 minutes, whereas the CR123A is 165 minutes. Um, and like I said, I think it's I think 18650s charge better and uh, last longer. They can charge more. And like any kind of battery, if you charge it a bunch of times over time, it's, it doesn't last as long as it did. It seems like 18650s last, like they they keep their charge longer for a longer period of time. So. Um, yeah, all the more benefits to just use that kind of battery, unless you know you're already doing that kind of thing. Cool, but just something that I wanted to point out. All right, so since we're not going to be able to do a demonstration here of the light itself today, because I want to compare it to the S1R and I need batteries for it, uh, let's just go over this really quick. Uh, like I said, I like to keep all my videos pretty short. So, flashlight is pretty much what you see here. All my American viewers out there, which is probably the bulk of you, if you actually read the manual, you'll see that it was 103 millimeters, which is about four inches long, by 23 millimeters, which is about 0 0.906 inches. So those are your dimensions for it. Even though I can't actually demonstrate this flashlight, seeing as it doesn't have a battery in it right now, I'll have to go through my batteries when I get my battery for the um, other flashlight for the demonstration, but for now, um, if you hold this switch, this will cycle through the low, medium, and low, medium, high, and turbo modes, just like all the other ones. Um, it does have this nice little deep pocket clip. This pocket clip is pretty sturdy feeling, so should not fall out. Uh, this is probably good for your shirt pocket more than your pants pocket, but. Uh, that's what I intend on using it for anyway. All right, so now that we're done with the uh, unboxing of it, uh, I'm gonna do the demonstration. Can't do a demonstration today because I don't have batteries, so we'll just have to do this whole thing again tomorrow. I'll edit it in. You won't even know that a day has passed. Um, other than that, I mean, you saw the specs. This is 950 lumens. Uh, I'm gonna compare it to the S1R, which is uh, 1,000. 
So we'll see which one actually is brighter and I'll do a little demonstration about how they fit in your pocket, stuff like that and carrying it and stuff because the weight, uh, it's pretty light. Uh, I don't know how it's going to be with the battery in it. Uh, it uses a different kind of battery so I haven't used that kind of battery for a flashlight. So I'll, uh, I'll add all that stuff in the demonstration. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, so this is the mandatory uh, demonstration of how the pocket clip works. And as you can see here, this is the shirt pocket and a little beard action there. All right, I guess this is the SR, S1R, the smaller flashlight. And for anyone uh, questioning where it was made, this is the S2 by the way, anyone questioning where it was made, it is Echo in China, so made in China, folks. So not American made. All right, this is the S2 pocket. Looks good. Looks good. Yeah, take that one out. All right, here's the S1R again. Pants pocket, how it fits. Sturdy pocket. But look at that. Right in the pocket. You don't even know it's there. You don't even know it's there. All right, a little bit of ass action right there. And here comes the S2. Focus, focus, there we go, here we go, here we go. All right, and again, right in. All right, now to the light demonstration. Okay, everyone. Yes, it is very dark outside because we are gonna test these flashlights. So, I'll have to adjust the focus because I can't tell if it's focused or not because it's pitch black out here. But we are gonna start off with the S2 and run through some of the features. I do have my batteries now, so this should work. And there we go. Autofocus is not going to focus on light. So let's try to focus on the fence. Come on. All right. So this is the low setting, medium setting, high setting, and let's see. Oh, that's low. Okay. Did that wrong. Okay. So this is low. Uh, low medium, high, turbo. This is the turbo setting. And you could tell before it was pitch black and now we have light. Okay, also comment on this mic because I'm using this little pin mic thing I got going on here. I have no idea if it's working right or not. Okay, so we're gonna kill that mic. I mean, <laughs> kill that light. All right, so this is the S1R. I don't even remember the settings. I think it's just low, medium, and high. We'll find out. All right. So low. I don't even know if you can see that in the camera. Medium. Medium there. High. And that's it. So it does have a strobe light effect as well. All right. So we'll try to compare these two side by side. So low i don't know if you can see it this is low on the s1r Oop, that didn't work okay we're having some technical difficulties here here we go okay after the technical difficulties this is low on the s2 on your left low on the s1 on your right i doubt you can see that so let's go to medium okay so that's medium on the S1, or yeah, the S1 on your right, and medium on the S2. So we'll take them, I'm going to take the S1 out of the picture. So this is just the S2, just the S1, side by side. That's pretty much the same, at least at this, and we're about, oh, I don't know. 20 feet from this fence maybe so all right and then we're gonna do high okay that's high on the s1 high on the s2 so this is the s2 okay and this is the s1 all right those are both on high now the s1 doesn't have a turbo so we're going to compare turbo versus high and I mean, it is close. Really, really close. I'm gonna try to test this going the other way. Come on, it's so hard to focus. You can see what my backyard looks like now, guys. Okay, so this is the turbo on the S2. 
Uh, that's about 20 yards or so, okay? And this is the high of the S1. So you can tell here that the S1 is not as good, or it doesn't illuminate as much as the turbo on the S2. So, yeah, that's the high setting on the S1, turbo setting on the S2. So, the S1 says 1,000 lumens and the S2 says 950, but it does appear that the S2 is going to win this round. So that's where I will conclude this video, guys. Um, both of these microphones, microphones, I'm saying microphone because I'm thinking about my microphone not working. Anyway, I'm going to try to hold these lights so you guys can see something but a black screen while I'm talking. Um, yeah, both of these uh, lights are pretty good. Uh, one's a little bit bigger, and I believe that it illuminates further. So that is my analysis. I uh, hope you guys like this video. I want you guys to like and subscribe and drop some comments below. And until next time, guys.